What's up Goombas? Today we're gonna be talking about the Taps chest rig and how it's super fucking badass. Stay tuned, we're gonna light it up. Just gonna, just gonna give my general impressions and opinions on the uh, TAPS chest rig system. I've been running it for about four-ish months out in the BB Wars, BB War Service 10 Hut Army. I love it, it's, it really is a good chest rig. A lot of people harp and complain and bitch and moan about the Y harness suspender system. Oh, my back hurts, it's cause it's Y. Shut the fuck up. I don't have an issue with it. It's not uncomfortable. I got my mags loaded up with 75 grain. Oak tail hollow point. And there are eight of them, bad mamma jammas in here. Um, and it, it's not uncomfortable at all. Another thing people aren't a big fan of is these Velcro flaps. I mean, I kind of get it. I understand, like, it's like kind of cringe or whatever. Maybe you want, everyone wants to cut them off and put the bungee cord stuff on there. I don't have an issue with these either. I think they're totally fine and serviceable. When I'm crawling around on the in, in the dirt, they keep a lot of crap from a lot of debris from getting into the actual mag pouch itself. The biggest downside I would say to the TAPS chest rig system is just the magazine pouches themselves are very tight on P mags and it it can be <laughs> Don't buy this chest rig, bro. What the fuck? This isn't even an exaggeration. It can be like that hard to pull out your P-Mag. Um, so that's kind of, that is something to really consider. Um, Shut up, mom! <laughs> All right, so just don't run P-Mags in them. I guess I, I gotta go buy Stenag, Stenag mags now, steel mag. Um, so yeah, Taps Chest Rig, check them out. Oblast Militaria, eBay shop. Got them really affordably priced. Very competitive pricing, very best pricing. Catch you around. That's a wrap. Another YouTube video that'll get 150 views. <laughs> Fucking mom's coming down here. It's bullshit. Don't. I don't want dogs. What are you doing? Yeah, you ruined it. Sorry. I'm just kidding. You're good. <sighs> yeah, this F-250 might not look like a whole lot, but it'll rip the nuts off of your fucking Dodge 1500, brother.